at the British School of Washington, what we want to do is to ensure that students leave here with great grades, as great learners and being great people. At the British School of Washington, there's a real buzz about the school. The children are really enthusiastic and excited to learn, and we try and provide those opportunities for the children to be challenged in their learning. We are using an international curriculum from our two-year-old program all the way through the IB, but equally important, in every single classroom, children from all over the world are represented. The children work so well together. We talk to them about communication, cooperation, and how they build those skills, not just academic skills, so they are prepared for the world of work, for being out and about in the community. We encourage youngsters to continually reflect upon where they are, where it is they'd like to be, and what are the steps that they need in order to get there. The love of learning we engender in students is a phenomenal sight to see. And more often than not, I will be surprised by the students around me rather than them being surprised what I bring to the classroom. The teachers are enthusiastic about the children's learning. They'll talk to them about their progress, meeting their personal best, achieving everything that they can, both personally, academically. We obviously support them when they need to be supported academically. We push them when they're ready to be accelerated. But most importantly, we're instilling a love of learning. We've created almost like a web of, of, of support and guidance through which young people uh, cannot fall. The environments we create, the curriculum that we're using, the staff that we have within this building, powerful forces to change people's lives. Our absolute ambition is to ensure that our students are ready for that transition, whether it's to another school, another country, to college, university, the world of work. We owe it to them to help them to be as ready as they can possibly be.